Okay, so I'm gonna start off. The reason that we're, my name's Guadalupe Valencia. I'm one of Ryan's advisors. Ryan Garcia's here, and his father's here, and his mother's here, uh, Lisa and, and Henry. And one of the reasons that we wanted to, one of the reasons that we wanted to have this uh, conference call and interviews is to kind of clarify uh, everything that's been in the press in the last couple days about this fight, and we think it's really important because there's some stories that are half true. Uh, some things that are inaccurate and we just wanted to set the record straight. So um, I'm going to make a statement about what, what transpired and then uh, we're going to take a couple questions so uh, you guys can ask questions if, if we miss something, okay? Everybody got it? Yep. Okay. Okay. So this is, uh, this is what happened. Uh, Ryan uh, was training for this fight for eight weeks. Uh, he was supposed to fight Avery Sparrow, which was a tough fight. And um, approximately on Tuesday, uh, I was notified, somebody told me, a good source of mine told me that Avery Sparrow had uh, an arrest warrant. And, you know, whenever I hear things like that, you try to, you know, do more investigation. You can't just say publicly somebody's got an arrest warrant. You know, these are real serious things. So. I reached out to the attorney who represents Golden Boy and I asked him if they had heard anything about this, if this was true or not. And he contacted me, he said, yes, this is true, we're working on it, we're gonna hire a lawyer, the warrant is out of Philadelphia, we're gonna try to clear everything up. And I said, okay, I need to know uh, as things are moving along because I gotta make a decision if and when I tell Ryan if this doesn't get resolved, okay? So that's on Tuesday. On Wednesday, I again contact them and I said, please give me a status about what's going on with Avery. And he sends me a text message. They said, we got a lawyer in Philadelphia and it's been resolved. The fight is gonna go forward, everything is fine. And I said, perfect, thank you. So that's Wednesday. So as of Wednesday, Golden Boy's lawyer informed me there's no problem, the warrant has been taken care of. So at this point, there's no reason to, to bother anybody in our camp about this, okay? Uh, and so that's what happened on Wednesday. So Wednesday's fine, Thursday's fine, uh, Friday morning comes and then they inform me um, about 11 o'clock that Avery had been arrested, okay? And it was a real shock to me because I had been, it had been represented to me that this issue had been resolved. So at this point I have to talk to Ryan about it, but even before that, just so you guys could understand all the efforts that we made to try to help out. Right. I myself personally went to the police station uh, where Avery was being held and met with the U.S. Marshals who had arrested him because I wanted to clarify what had happened, number one, and number two, whether there was any solution to this, whether there was any way to get him out of jail so that he could fight. And I spoke with the U.S. Marshals and they explained to me that there was no way that they were going to release him because whatever lawyer uh, they had hired in Philadelphia uh, did not get in writing any clearance on the warrant. And as they understood it, there was still an active warrant and they were taking him into custody. And that was it. And the story was over. And by by the time, at this time, it's now uh, 1230, 1245. And Ryan is at the weigh-in. And Ryan weighed in at 135 as he was supposed to. And then when I got back to the hotel, I had to inform Ryan what, what had happened. So. When Ryan says he didn't know anything about this, he's 100% right. And uh, Golden Boy's attorney made these representations to us and we relied on these representations and this is what happened. So um, during these conversations, uh, we also, uh, you know, we also had a, a very small discussion about a replacement if this did get resolved. And they said, uh, they, they asked if we'd fight Duno. And I said, yes but for more money. We weren't gonna fight Duno for the same amount of money, okay? That was the only discussion that happened before Friday.